Miami 21, Hurricanes 10 and 2. 10 and 2 with the most likely losses would be Clemson and Texas A&M. Or maybe a split against those two and they trip up against somebody that they shouldn't lose to. What's really odd about the chat tonight is on my screen, I can't, it gets stuck. I can't see like the most recent couple comments. But then it keeps going and then I can eventually see it, but I can't see the the most recent few. Again, we apologize for Cam not being here tonight. Everything's fine. He just couldn't make it tonight. Um, he contacted me about 5 o'clock, but I had back-to-back-to-back-to-back-to-back-to-backs and did not see it until right before we came on tonight. So we'll be back um, Thursday night at 8 with a wholesome one. So be looking out for that. Uh, mobile for life, BW, uh, going undefeated is a huge long shot. Is it possible? Yeah. There's nobody on the schedule that Miami cannot beat. They could go to Texas A&M and win. I give them a 25% chance of going to Clemson and, or I give them a 25% chance of going to each one and winning. Um, so they probably, what's that? more like a 50% chance. What is that? 45 to 50% chance of winning one of those two games. Uh, uh, Knox King 94 on. Uh, okay. Sure. I thought it was going to be something good for me when I started to read that comment. Falcon Rex uh, tomorrow night, Thursday night, we'll have the wholesome one here. I am going to go talk some Texas football here in a few minutes. Okay, Mr. HD, let's keep in mind, last season I picked Miami to go 9-3, and three, and they let me down at 7-5. and five. The 8-3 and three year in 2020, I did pick that. I nailed that. Perfect. 8-3 in 2020. 2019, I picked Miami to go 8-4, and four, and I got lambasted here for picking Miami to lose four games. And of course they went six and six. So that's, that's the last three years track record. I can't remember before that, but last year I picked a nine and three, seven and five was the result nailed the 2020 season, eight and three. Then the year before I went eight and four. So they I'm, I'm four games. I am overestimated Miami by four games. Okay. Mr. HD, you're going to make up for it. Uh, yeah, my early estimation would be right there with Die Hard, I think, at a nine and three. But we will see. We will see. Going to save on that prediction for right now. I think I picked Miami at number 16 in my preseason, way too early, top 25. I think that was my slot for them, if I remember. <laughs> 